Now this, that, that was a good proposal. <laughs> Lord. interesting uh if you look at what hubble the hubble images in fact that nebula that you're showing right there the ring nebula there's that was that was imaged by hubble which is a telescope i worked on as an astronaut i got two trips there an amazing telescope but now with Webb, we can image that same thing and see much more so the detail that james webb is able to show us is particularly in the this the section of of light the infrared the infrared uh, infrared section of the of, of light those wavelengths which are very, very dim light coming from stars and dust far away from us. Uh, it's able to detect those things much better than Hubble would. And that's when you look at those images next next to each other, you see how much more detail I we have. I wonder if there is a way to split screen, just yeah, to notice the difference. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, so it seems like that's really what's so incredible here, right? Is the yeah. fact that this telescope can see so much and also that it's finding things that we previously did not know about. Could you foresee this? Oh, there's a split screen actually, right? Um, could you see this doing that if, with other bigger discoveries, finding something we didn't know about our universe? Yeah, absolutely, Savannah. I think what we're still seeing with, with Webb is that it's fairly new. I mean, it was about yeah. six months ago or so where it started to warm up and we got those first images over the summer. So you usually start out slow with these things, making sure it's working, imaging things like the, like the Southern Nebula that we saw. Uh, imaging those things that you know about and looking at differences and now you learn how you can use it and what they what they're seeing is things that they never thought they would discover what they thought was two stars orbiting each other they found a third star now it looks like they might have a fourth and fifth star in that one region so they're able to see a lot more because of the sensitivity in, in of this new telescope that's up there and now they're going to start pointing at other things, and who knows what they're going to discover. So I think they're just warming up. When these images are coming back to NASA, yeah. is everybody like, oh my God, <laughs> they're digging no. out. I think yeah, so, I yeah. Like it's like, wow, look yeah. what we find. And that's the cool thing about this astronomy uh, that we see coming out of Hubble in the past and now with Webb is that we're now uh, not just answering questions, but we're coming up with like kind of the answer first, like, oh, what is that? And then you ask the question, because you don't even know what question to ask. Yeah.